sound okay? Actually, I just finished playing through it, so I figured while the game's so fresh in my mind, I'll, I'll run through it for a recording. So, right, hmm, I'm trying to, figure, I'm trying to remember the order of this. Okay, so basically, you have the remote, the remote is your, that's how you change channels to do whatever you get. Um, where do I start? Starting the, starting the street. There, dude. The street, everything can be done in the street in, in one uh, one pass. So I, you know, uh, a lot of these levels make you go, they make you kind of backtrack and do other stuff. Uh, you know, you, like you, you'll get an item and then you use the item at a different stage. Oops. Uh, oh, the, the damage here is pretty pretty insignificant only because you get uh, okay, I didn't mean to take that much damage. Uh, the acid does a lot of health. I thought I was getting hit by the rats, but I guess I was getting hit by the acid. Oh, my bad. Um, I'm still in okay shape. If I have to restart, I'll restart at the beginning of the game. Let's back over to Beavis. Uh, what up? What up? Check it back, I actually don't need it. You just had a habit, I always switch the butt head to get the... Uh, I do not own Zoom. Okay, so I got the machine gun. Uh, I, actually, I don't have very many, to be honest with you, man. But, um, all my Genesis games are pretty much stuff that I had when I was when I was a kid. When I was a kid, I rented a lot of games, so I never really bought a game. The the boot you can pick up, but doesn't do anything, so I run by it. Oh. This guy to spawn, turn him around, pin him, you know, pin him against the little wall, the little crate. Keep on shooting until he dies. Boom, you get health. So the way to switch is you uh, you hit pause, you hit, you hit the start button, uh, you hit the B button, you switch between the two. Uh, each, I think each of them can hold three or four items. I, I, I think it's three. I'm pretty sure because I, I I've uh, maxed it out a few times just playing. Where it, it'll tell you like I can't I can't hold anything else or whatever. Pretty sure it's three. Ah, taking some bad damage here. Switch. So this is kind of the same idea as like Ninja Turtles, honestly, for the Nintendo. Like you can switch between the two characters. And, uh, I already picked up one. So this I actually have to play, uh, kind of a little, little cleaner than last time, because I only got one of them left. Oh, jeez. Uh. Thank <laughs> you. 
Uh, so run, you hold A, and then jump is the B button, which is pretty standard, I think, as far as positioning of your fingers and stuff. Um, okay. It should be close to the end of the server. So since Butthead has the machine gun, I'm going to go ahead and switch back to him. Uh, okay, that's, that should be enough. Okay, so you gotta fight. It's early Hank Hill. It's not a Hank Hill, but in the cartoon, he's basically the same character, same voice. Okay, so with the dog, so this whole game is kind of like a puzzle game. You have to like drag and use items in certain areas to progress. Uh, pretty much everything except for the end. Um, I actually remembered from when I was you know, a little kid. Like, cause I, I played yeah. Yeah, not only a whole lot of games, I played the hell out of the ones I owned. So I do remember a lot of this stuff. Played from all those years ago, which is kind of interesting, you know, you... At first I forgot everything, and then as I, as I played through, I kind of started remembering all the different stuff I had to do. So, it's pretty... It's interesting how, how, you know, how the mind works that way. Okay, so I'm gonna spawn this guy again. And this guy's kind of dangerous to spawn, because you can tell, as you can see, he can shoot, he can shoot at you. Usually, if I'm low on health, I'll run to the mall. And the mall has a, a regenerating security guard that you can keep on uh, killing for health. Okay, so now... So this is how you get rid of your pieces that you pick up. You go over to the poster and you pop in the poster and hit start to keep on going. It, actually, it also saves your game, which is nice. And I, I, I go there frequently just because you have to, because your inventory is so small. You have to get rid of the pieces. Or if not, I would just run through the whole game. But you can't, you can't hold them, all the stuff. So I'm gonna run to Burger World. Uh, we'll we'll see if it's no death. I'm I'm, I'm gonna try. Uh, that thing in the corner, I don't. So we'll. Okay, so you need... Whoa, we need a doctor. Okay, so now I'm sick. So in order to get past this part, you just type in butthead. And then it opens. Yeah, if it happens to be no death, it might be. I don't know. That's why I didn't want to label it. Um... So th there's actually only one area that I could possibly die in, because because I, I mean this game this game really isn't that difficult. It's just kind of figuring out little puzzles, so it's not I mean it's not that hard. But uh, okay, so you okay, well, just gotta hit me. Go in, pick up. Thanks, Chris. <laughs> nation member for life. Okay, so you run around. Get the piece. There's a little hidden food up here, I think. Yep. Okay, then. Alright, so since uh, since I'm sick... Actually, I'm going to run to the poster real quick. Drop off the piece of... Uh... Yeah, Conan was a hard one. <laughs> that one took me a little while. Okay, so I'm going to run over to the hospital. I'm sick. There you go, you go to the hospital when you're sick. Actually, the health I... Who's here is irrelevant. I'm gonna get all my health back anyway. Well, I make tons of mistakes. I'm, I'm not good at games. I, I just get lucky. Alright, so you, the only way you can get in that door is if you're sick. So you have to eat that burger and get your life back. Scissors will use for later. So here's the part where I can I can die. 
So this guy's chasing you and you have to avoid all these medical bags. Each bag puts him one, I guess like one unit closer to you. And if he's right next to you, then you die. Like he jumps on you. But you can actually, so where he's standing right now, I can actually keep him, even if I get hit by something, I can keep him there. Because uh, after a while, he ends up moving backwards a little bit. So you, hopefully, I don't completely mess it up. Okay, yeah, he's back. So once his hands are down, I'm safe. I can get hit one more time again. And down the stairs. Okay, get the... Alright, so I should actually be in the clear for a no death at this point. We'll see. Run over here. Alright, Drop the piece yeah. off. Okay, um. You know what? What, am I, what should I do next? Okay, so I'll do. I'll do some of the stuff in the mall next. That's what I'll do. Cause I, I need to go there anyway to, to sell some of the stuff that I stole, like the headset and that little duck. Right, that? I gotta go to the mall. Switch over to play <laughs> because she's got the machine gun. Actually, I'm gonna do a, a, a Karate Kid trick. So you, as long as you keep one one enemy on the screen, a second one won't appear in front of you, which is nice. Okay, so I, I should have got I got money for that thing. Yeah. Okay, so <laughs> well, he's yeah, so you buy the snake for fifty cents that that guy gave. Cool. While he's packaging it, you have to grab the key. Watch out for shopping carts. Okay, I don't have my laundry stuff yet. Okay. I do. You know what? I'll, I'll do that too. Alright man, take it easy. Thanks for thanks for stopping by for a little bit. Okay, good. So here I should, I should be able to get the, the laundry mat area all fixed up and ready to go. It's also good because it's good for, for uh item management too, because I'll be able to get rid of okay I got the oil so the only way to open this door without open without uh, making the old lady up is you have to use the oil first because if you don't it squeaks it wakes her up and then you're stuck there you can't get out so there you go now I'm gonna run upstairs I'm gonna sell some of well actually first I'm gonna yeah, I'm gonna sell some of my stuff, but I need to get rid of inventory. I gotta pick up a couple things here. Okay. Right, so. Okay, so now I have enough money to finish the game at this point. So you run over here, you pick up the bomb. Use a snake on this guy, he scares him away. So you actually don't need the these secret documents, so I might actually just just pitch them later. Um, what else do I have to do over here? I don't need the bat. Oh, I'm, I'm done. I think I'm done with this with them all. Okay, so now I can get out. This guy, spawn him, uh, get hit, and then just run around. Okay. And I gotta keep him on screen. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna kill him for a little bit of help. Okay. Then I'm gonna run and uh, drop off the ticket pieces I've gotten. 
It should be a couple. All right, only three left. So. Next, we're gonna head over to the driving. You need the picture, or you need the picture? How stupid! You need the camera for. We're there, dude. So that was that. He's the bomb there. Alright. <laughs> that was cool. Yeah. <laughs> Make your way over. Like, uh, these oil slicks or what? Or these, like, tar slicks or whatever you want to call them. Like, you sell those? I don't think you actually use them. Anyway. You take a picture of this lady. She gets all crazy. And you have to run away. See, so, so this is where the these little tar things start you up. Because she can hit you. Like, she catches up to you and hits you. Run up to this area. Some slips. Get a few pieces like that. Alright, stop it. Trying to figure out what's in Oh, the stuff in the school is next. Okay, the school, and then I think the. The couch. Oh, uh, okay, yeah. yeah. There's one two left. And I can't, so there's one where you have to go couch fishing, which I'll actually do now. Wait, what do I need? Oh, I need a pizza or something. Okay. Hey, shut up! I got something. <laughs> Should be the cat. Okay. Now I'm going to the school. Where's there, dude? This part took me the longest to remember how to do. You, you just have to burp, you have to burp and fart on him. But that's kind of frustrating. You, you just take damage and tell him. So you run here, you pick up the gum. You can talk to him. He, he I don't know if every time you load the level it changes, but he, he changes stuff that he says. He, he gives you hints on how to do most of this stuff. So like that one references the, the drive-in. There's another reference for um what's the other one he talks about. Uh, I don't know. Now you run. So you do. Wait for the ticket. Place the exploding stuff. Knocks him out. Then you make your way back. Trying to avoid that thing. Ow. 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 Yeah, that's fine. Yeah. 
I'm out of there. So now I can run over to the poster. The poster should be fixed. Finished. Right. Oh, wait. Yeah. Oh, I'm stupid. Okay. One more. I forgot. I didn't do the catch fishing. Okay, so I gotta do. The... Okay, so this is a little. Hey, this one gives you an end of it. You pull up Daria. She says something about the thing is being stuck to gum. But you suck the gum. Hey, yeah, you don't have to I do Daria it. first, but right? you can just do this. But I'm trying to show you it's how you know, what to, you know how to do it. Last piece of ticket. So and I, I didn't mention I didn't mention it because I didn't we didn't see it, but uh, but in the bathroom in the mall, that's where you find out. Uh, that the passcode for the door right. at the burger joint yeah. is yeah. butthead. Like, it's on the wall. Cool. And I didn't show it because it's why. But, okay, so we got all the, we got all the, all the stuff we need. We got the two tickets. Yeah, I don't know. You can sell those for money if you really need them. You, you, you can buy guns and stuff in the, you can buy weapons in the mall. You need extra money for that. So I need the cat. And I need. Okay, so now we can. You know what? I'm actually I'm gonna run to the mall real quick and get butthead some health. We're there, dude. Just because I the the area I have to go through is kind of annoying. I don't want to die at the end. So I'm gonna we're gonna go ahead and get full health before I head to the concert. Because I'm going to give you guys a special treat. I'm going to show you guys how to get backstage. Well, the, the game would normally end if you just go into the front door. But there is a way to get backstage. So, why not show you guys? Okay, Oop. Okay, we're all good to go here. So we're going to go ahead and go to the show. We're there, dude. So I have the tickets, the si scissors, and he has the cat. Okay. All right. so enjoy the show. Okay, so I got Okay, so you use the cat. Over there. See, so, so the, that that dog will kill you. Like it, 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 and there's no way to get around him. You have to use it. You have to use Okay, you know what? So I can just do this, I think. Well, the reason why I used Butthead there was because I need to switch over to Beavis and he's going to take some damage from this guy before I can kill him. So. Boom. Dead. You put... <laughs> That's your costume. <laughs> you, uh, you need to get one of those. And you walk backstage. Right. And you dance with the guard. Uh, no, cool. yeah. You can just move left and right. Can you switch? Yeah. Okay, yeah, so C is to switch. And then uh, B is to do like your... Cool. Oh, it looks like an elbow drop. Yeah. But yeah, I mean, this... Yeah. The only thing that took me a while to remember how to do was the burping in yeah. that teacher's face to get the, the two potions. Right Everything else I do, sadly enough, I remember from when I was a little kid. So. Yeah, that's it. Um, I'm not sure what else to play right now. <laughs> um, game's over, so thanks for watching, and hope you guys liked it. Alright, so now I think I'm going to go through um, 